Yeah, guys, I have listened to you once again and I have ordered some LED lights here with an R7S socket. This is for our outside lighting here, our floodlights, which uh, currently have a 150 watt halogen light bulb inside. And I've got two of them, one on each side of the garage. So that's 300 watts every time it kicks in. And you can hear the inverter jumping when the light comes on. So I've decided to have a look on AliExpress and found these um, amazing light bulbs, which promised to be the same brightness as the 150 watt light bulbs currently installed. I'm not expecting this at all. I know they are not as bright as the other ones, but I don't need 150 watts here on the driveway actually. I don't want to play soccer in the night. I don't want to play tennis or doing any brain surgery or something, you know. It's just more when the light comes on, you know where you go, you don't trip over stuff and it's not pitch black. It's a 20 watt LEDs on both sides. Uh, cost me $7.29 including shipping and taxes for two of them. Okay, so before we change the light bulbs, I want to see how much saving we actually have. So at the moment we are discharging the battery with 1.7 amps. It's only the computer is running at the moment. So I'll turn on the outside light and we will see how much power we actually draw. So it's 92, 93 watts at the moment. Turn on the outside light and we are going from 90 watts to 380 watts. So that's 290, is that correct? Almost 290 watts. Okay, let's replace these light bulbs and then we see how much power we're actually saving. I'm actually not even sure if this is an R7S light bulb inside. I thought it is, but they look a little bit longer. They look a lot shorter. I oh, know, actually, they should fit. <laughs> I wasn't quite sure. I guess there's no danger in touching the glass, actually, because they're not getting hot anymore. Look how black this one is already. Okay, just checking, we are still at 90, 92 watts. And we turn on the outside light again. Couldn't hear any hum in the inverter when it turned on. Yeah, it looks a lot... Nah, actually it's pretty bright. It doesn't flicker in real life. That's only the camera. And this one, <laughs> it flickers totally in the camera. There's no flickering. <laughs> Okay, and this is now 103 watts from 92. Wow, that is a big saving, right? That is huge. All right, there we got the results. That is a 269 watts less, which is 72% less energy with these LED light bulbs. So far, that sounds really good, but we have to wait until it's dark to see actually the difference. But I think they should be fine. So there should be 40 watts then, right? For two light bulbs, but I'm measuring only 24 watts for both. Chinese accuracy again, we will see. I think, Houston, we've got a problem. Yeah. They are both still on. 
I think they are not turning off completely. Can I trigger this somehow here? No. They are very dimmed. You can actually see the single LEDs there. But I thought it has turned off now. How many watts do we have at the moment? 97, 95, 98. So it's only 5 watts or so. What's going on there? Okay, let's turn them off again and turn them back on. This should trigger the um, motion sensor. No, they are still... They wasn't long enough. Or maybe they are broken already. Okay, off. <laughs> they lasted exactly once. <laughs> okay, let's try again, turn it on. And hopefully they are full brightness now again. Yes, they are. Okay, so they are now super bright. And now we just wait until the motion sensor turns off. Shouldn't take long. Yeah, you could hear the click. But now they are still on. They are still on. Look at this. Why is that happening? You could re really hear the relay clicking inside the motion sensor. So I turned off the load, but it's still... It is still on. The light is still on. Very, very dimmed. And it's using like five... Like two or three watts or so. From 93, 92 we've seen. 96 now, 98. Uses a couple of watts now for standby, for... What's going on there? That is shit. Why is this working? They're both on. Yeah, this one too. You can see the single LEDs there. If it doesn't flicker too much. <laughs> well, there's no flickering in real world. That is just not good. I don't understand why this is happening because there is a relay turning off the load inside the motion sensor. Any ideas? Leave your comments down below. Okay, I did some googling of course, uh, so why this is happening. And it could be that we have to change the phase and neutral around and then it stops. There might be a very very small sense current flowing through the electronics of this cheap motion sensor light. And this is enough to keep the lights running. So, um, well, we are going shopping now, but uh, later when I come back this afternoon, I will change the um, face and neutral around and see if this makes a difference at all. I don't know. Sounds weird. Shouldn't work. They should be still on. Shouldn't make a difference at all. What a stupid light. Okay, I'm changing now neutral on active over and see if this makes a difference at all. I doubt it will. I think it's the electronic inside the motion sensor. What's so funny? Okay, so I just measured the voltage. Everything is turned off now. And we can just swap the black and the red one and see if this makes any difference at all. I have now swapped neutral and active on the light, on the motion sensor. We turn it back on. Okay, so that's the startup. It turns on. Let's wait until it turns off and see if it's still. <laughs> It's still the f in. It doesn't make a difference at all. Man, this is the second time now it happens to me in my life that the internet was not right. Okay, so what's the what's the solution for that? That the light stays on, even the relay has turned off. There's some sort of eddy current still flowing. Creepy ghost current. Okay, leave your comments down below. Just a quick video, just a quick update on the lighting situation here. I haven't done too much research on this, so leave your comments down below. I'm keen to read what solution you are coming up with. Okay, see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.